Hello, hi, I'm Claire Wigley and um, you might know me as one of the workers here at Canvas, so I work with Anne. Um, so this first exhibition, so it's very exciting and I just want to introduce you to my baby ladies. So the reason for doing them was really based on sort of family and friends that I've known over the years who are big, big world swimmers as it is now. And um, I just really love the freedom that they have and that expression that they have and the excitement as well. And I wanted to capture that and so the humour behind it and also just normalise women doing normal things, you know, getting away from that whole media portrayal of we've got to have the perfect figure and the perfect life and balancing everything perfectly and, and what have you. And it's, that's not life. So um, for me, it was really important to, to give people, not just women, although these are women that I've painted, I want people to connect with the feeling of what they're doing, how they're enjoying their, their life as themselves with their family and friends. There's a little element in there of the fear that I have and the anxiety of going into the water. So um, I blame a lot of that on watching the film Jaws because that film had a huge impact on me. And it's, it's also based on a respect of the sea. You know, it's, it's such a beautiful but dangerous place. And yet it gives people this enjoyment of freedom. And I kind of wanted to capture that in, in, in the essence of it in a painting. So some of them will be about someone in the water just loving it and enjoying it and being in that moment. And others, it might be, you know, a group activity, you know, something they need to do daily. It's like a therapy for them. And for me, I love the sea. I do, I really enjoy being by it. I just don't like to be in it. Up to my knees, I'm okay, but beyond that, no. And then I've also kind of been inspired by other artists that it's not necessarily the greatest painters, but what they portray is what really connects me to the image. And that's what I wanted. I didn't want to be bogged down in all the detail and it's got to be so perfect that it, it loses that element of fun and enjoyment. So for me, I painted big because it allowed me to create these scenes, these vistas that I see that are just such big parts of me. And also there's that humour of maybe there's a little story in there. So I have sort of, yeah, I've really wanted to capture that. And I've, I've just used acrylics because I've only got a small space to work in. So, you know, time is limited and I can't make a big mess and leave it out. So acrylics work really well for me. And then I've also produced some smaller pieces and I've used sort of digitalised the image and worked on that and over it and then recreated it as a painting. So for instance, this piece here, Pineapple Lush, simply because she's having a luscious time and she's got pineapples on her swimsuit. I did that as a drawing and then I, I put that into an app and then I worked on it as a digital piece to work out colours and the composition and what I wanted to achieve. And then I kind of recreated it loosely then onto my canvas. And I've done that with a couple of pieces that are in this exhibition. But mostly it's kind of from a memory or an idea of a scene or something that's been sort of triggered, you know, an emotion that I wanted to create in it. So for me, there are little stories in each painting, but obviously it's what you see in them. And it's and it's just enjoy art, you know, don't don't worry about it being perfect that's not what it's about it's about what you get from it you know as as the viewer as a potential buyer as someone who's just there for that moment enjoying it you know art is just so fantastic it's anyone can enjoy it it doesn't matter who you are what you're doing you could just love it and i really hope people have enjoyed my exhibition as much as i enjoyed actually painting it so uh, yeah thank you very much